Oh, you guys. Happy Halloween. Let's see here. Let me see. Who's ready for Halloween out there? <laughs> I have a spooky song for you. I am so excited about this song. Um, I've called it Ghostly Castle. And I was noodling around with it last night. So it's a work in progress, but I need to make an album of spooky tunes, I think. Hey, Michael. You know what? I think I need to move the ankle down a little bit. Hold on. Bear with me. Let me move you down so that you can see my hands a little bit better. That'll make it more interesting. Is that better? That's better. Hey, you guys. You know what? Maybe before I play you my ghostly castle tune. Let's get in the Halloween vibe a little bit. So, for those of you in the studio and on Patreon, we have a Halloween themed virtual studio circle on Friday, which I would love to see you there. I will be dressed up as the Queen of Hearts as always, and we will play, we'll play some spooky tunes and just have a little Halloween time together. So um, recently I got these little cards. I think we did, I pulled one for, for fall last, I think it was maybe the last live stream we did. These are from um, an Etsy store and Samhain is the time of year that we are going into the, the dark time of the year, right? So um, it says decorations and symbols, apples, flowers, fall flowers, Nuts and berries, candles, brooms. I've got a broom back there. <laughs> I wish it would fit in the in the screen a little bit better. I've got a little spider. See my friend, my spider friend. Um, smoky quartz, which I have, and I have some tourmaline. Mm -hmm. I also have a blessed pumpkin. <laughs> And one of my favorite things, the eyeball. <laughs> okay, let me play you this spooky tune. This is so cool. I'm going to just play you some spooky inspired Halloween music on the harp. So you just go about your spooky day and I will just play you what comes to mind here. But this one in particular is called Ghostly Castle. So...
that so awesome? <laughs> it's a little work in progress, so I just love that. Love, love, love that. So that was the ghostly castle. And let's see what other things we can kind of come up with. I always like to um, just kind of see what the universe comes up with. I have two harps. I have one in the background and I have this one. Hey there, Jake. And hey, everybody. Thank you. <laughs> Thanks for hanging out. Um, let's see. Super cool. I think my witch's hat needs another witch's hat. Let's see. What are you guys doing for hell? It's like a it's like a little pimple hat. A little pimple on the on my black hat. <laughs> or like a wart or something. This is the C harmonic minor scale. Listen to how cool this is. with this. My hat's gonna fall off. different key. So rather than being in the harmonic minor, let's go to the Dorian. You all know I love the Dorian mode, right?
song that's actually written. <laughs> You guys, thank you for listening. Thank you, thank you. Let's see, you know, I didn't make my cup of tea because I made a great big cup of coffee this morning. And um, I already had all of the caffeine that I can handle today. <laughs> so maybe we just chat a little bit. Tell me how you've been doing. Look at this beautiful scarf that I bought. Isn't this the most beautiful thing you've ever seen? This hat, I'm sorry, this hat is. And also these earrings, can you see these earrings? These are from my favorite store in media called Silver Moon Antiques. Silver Moon Antiques. Um, let me see if I can find... Oh, you're on my phone. I was going to say, I, I forget her Instagram, my friend's Instagram account. Um, it's like Silver Moon underscore antiques or something. Silver Moon Studio Antiques. She has the best stuff. She made these. And I also got this scarf here from her too. So, And I think this hat as well. Anyways, you guys been okay? Have you been watching my Shradiac videos? <laughs> you know, we're studying all the Shradiac um, things on Patreon. So if you are interested and you need a little bit more musical direction, sorry, my hair. Um, we're doing a whole Shradiac series on Patreon. And I've just shared the first videos from that series. But if you want to continue with that, we're going to learn all the hand patterns. We're going to learn all of Shradiac number one do some bowings, do some speed work, work on intonation, all that stuff. I just, my hat like makes my hair look so much better. <laughs> Let's put the hat back on. And um, this is a busy week for the studio. So let me tell you what's going on for us. So Thursday is our violin group class, which I teach every other Thursday. It is a fabulous little class. And um, we're just working with Leopold Auer's Great Course of Violin Playing Book One. You can join that, it's only $30 to join and um, send me a line, you know, if you're not sure if it's right, a right fit for you and we can talk about it. And look at how fabulous this little, you know, tiny hat is. <laughs> and then on Friday, like I said, we have our virtual studio circle and we're gonna, I'm gonna lead us through some stretches, some breathing exercises. We will play some Halloween tunes. I'll guide us through some Halloween tunes we can do. And then as always, whoever wants to play something can practice playing something. 
and we can chat about whatever musical, you know, is on your mind. If you have any questions about anything. And that is, that's something that I do for the studio, but it's also something you can join via the Patreon community. So if you want a little musical community that's lovely, come join us on Patreon. It's the last Friday of every month that we get together on Zoom, and it's really nice. And then on Saturday is our in-person group class. We're gonna do a Halloween um, group class here at a coffee shop after hours. It's in Media, um, Pennsylvania. And we're gonna play through some fabulous little medieval tunes and dress up in Halloween costumes. <laughs> so that'll be really fun. I'm excited about it. And yeah, so the, this week is quite busy for the studio. I'm working on recording things for you guys. Um, especially for the Patreon community. And I did record something about um, my exercise routine because I did mention that I've lost around 20 pounds. And I know that some of you were interested in how I did that because I know all of us probably have a few pounds to lose. Um, sorry, my hat, I will just take it off. I will take it off. And so I thought I would share that, but it's kind of a long video and I just don't know that I really, really liked it very much. So I might just redo that. Thank you, Artistic Atri, Atri. <laughs> what a lovely name, I love that. Thank you, and thank you for your comment, and thank you for being here. Um, yeah, so so I might make a video about that. Um, another one, just to redo it. Do you have any requests about videos you'd like to see? If you do, just you know, comment them below or leave them on my videos, and I could even show you some harp videos. I mean, I'm not, a professional harpist at all. I'm just learning the harp. I'm learning the harp from the universe. <laughs> but if you're interested in, in any little things, feel free to comment them below. And if you have any requests, like I said, for, for violin or viola videos, let me know as well. I would really love to record some actual videos of me playing, but um, I, it's like a one woman show, you know? And so I just, I'm not the best with technology and I'd really love to like go play underneath a tree, but I'm worried about the wind and like if the wind will get in the way and I guess I should just kind of do it. To be honest, I should hire one of my little ones to do it for me because they are so technological. They could probably, you know, figure it out in two seconds. But anyways, you guys, what are you doing for Halloween? Do you have anything that you're doing for Halloween? Do you have any Halloween songs that you particularly like? I really like Lorena McKennett. I know she's not super Halloween, but she's like very magical. I love Lorena McKennett. And um, I've been listening to the Rocky Horror Picture Show. <laughs> and the Rocky Horror is one of my favorite musicals. I'm not a super musical fan, but I love the Rocky Horror Picture Show. In fact, I was thinking it'd be really funny to um, like just come onto the screen and, and do the like the intro song to that would be so like put some like red lipstick on and um, <laughs> I need to learn the guitar then I could one of these days when I learn the guitar I will do the intro to the Rocky Horror with the red lips and playing the guitar and and everything that would be so funny but anyways well I have to set up for lessons today you guys thank you for joining me and um, I hope you have a magical Halloween if you are interested in any of the Halloween things that we are doing as a studio. All of my information is on my website, which is Violin Viola Masterclass. You can find all my stuff that I do on my website. Um, Instagram is Violin Viola Masterclass. Patreon is Violin Viola Masterclass. And um, Mediocre Violin is Hey You. Over the Garden Wall is my favorite Halloween show. I've never seen that. I've never seen that. We've been watching Once Upon a Time and um, um, Ghostbusters. Ghostbusters, what else? Um, I'm sure there's been some of the ones that we've been watching. Nothing too, nothing like too horrifying. Like, you know, there's, it, yeah. <laughs> we want like more magic. Oh, Hocus Pocus. Hocus Pocus is a good one. Love, love, love. So anyway, oh, the other thing, before you go, I have been taking a psychic development class for the last year and a half with Psychic Bob Hickman. And it's that time of year where some of you might be wanting to get readings or do more like psychic things. And I just want to give a shout out to him because he is wonderful. I play the harp before the class starts every Saturday. You can go to his website. It's, um, let me find my tablet so I can show you. And you can join his Saturday psychic class if you're interested in kind of doing some more psychic-y things. 
you know, during this time of year. Let's see here. So I think it is just Robert Hickman dot com. Nope. <laughs> well, his channel is Spirit Channel. I'm not sure why it's so hard to find his website. Let me see here. Let me go to, he's actually doing live readings right now. I just saw um, Spirit Channel, Messages from the Spirit World with Psychic Bob. As band music. He's such a sweetheart. And I just love him. I'm sorry, you see, you see how technological I am? It, like technologically challenged. I'm trying to share <laughs> Spirit. Well, I'll link it below, I'll link below. I'll link his channel below. Then you can kind of check it out, but it's lovely. Um, he is an amazing psychic medium, and he teaches a Saturday class where you can learn all about, you know, psychic things. It's actually really helped me in, in lots of ways. I don't know. If, I mean, it's definitely helped me um, develop in some, in like, n not normal ways, you know. Um, but it's neat to learn about, you know, from an actual professional psychic. That's what he does 24-7. He's a sweetie pie. So just, I'll link it below, or just check out Spirit Channel, Robert Hickman, and, and just check him out and send him some love. And I'll see you in his class if you're there. So anyways, you guys, his class is from 12 to 2, basically, on Saturdays, every Saturday. His website, you can, you can pay, you know, to join. But anyways, I think on that note... it a day. Go have a cup of tea and a scone. <laughs> Get some practice in and I'll see you all very soon. Thanks again for being here. I'll see you later.